Hello friends, in this video we will see if three persons working together so how many days they will take to finish the work. Let us assume there are three persons are there A, B and C. A takes X days <coughs> to finish the work and B takes Y days to finish the same task and C takes Z days to finish the same task. If A is taking X days, that means he is finishing 1 by X part of the work per day. So if B is taking Y days to finish the same work, he is finishing 1 by Y part of the work per day. If Z, if C is finishing in Z days, that means he is finishing 1 by Z part of the work per day. Okay, so then the work finished by A, B and C together in one day is given by 1 by X plus 1 by Y plus 1 by Z. So this is the work finished by A, B and C together in one day. Okay, so this if you solve this equation, so it is going to be X, Y, Z yz xz plus xy so this is the work they are going to be finished per day if they are working together so to get the number of days we have to reverse this equation numerator to denominator and denominator to numerator okay so that one will give the number of days a b and c together taken to finish the work so that is going to be xyz by xy yz plus zx so these are the number of days taken by a b and c together to finish the work so let's see one example problem based on this concept let us assume a takes 20 days to finish the work and b takes 30 days to finish the work and c takes 60 days to finish the work. So if A, B and C working together, I mean all are finishing the same work. Okay. If A, B and C are working together, then how many days they will take? So using this formula, we substitute the values x is 20 and y is 30 and z is 60 days. Substitute the values in this equation. So that is 20 into 30 into 60 by 20 into 30 plus 30 into 60 plus 60 into 20. So if you solve this equation, you will get 10. So that is 10 days. Okay. If A takes 20 days, B takes 30 days, C takes 60 days to finish your work, to finish the same work. So if all three are working together, we will finish the work in 10 days. Okay. So there is another method to solve this kind of problems also. So here A takes 20, B takes 30 and C takes 60 days and we find the LCM of these three days. Okay. So that is 60. So we assume this 60 is the total number of work units. Okay. We assume that is the total work units they have to finish. So A takes 20 days. That means A is finishing 3 units per day. So B is taking 30 days. That means he is finishing 2 units per day. So C is taking 60 days. That means C is finishing 1 unit per day. So that means if all together are finishing 6 units per day. A, B and C all together are finishing 6 units per day. But actually they have to finish 60 units. So they are finishing 6 units per day. So that means they will take 10 days to finish 6 units. That means A, B and C together takes 10 days to finish the work. I hope you got this one. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel.